Bird's getting bigger. Oh, Carl, stop faffing around. Just say what you want to say. I wanted you to hear this from me before someone else got into your ear. Isabel is having a baby, and I am the father. Hey! I want a word with you. I, I do realise it's a, a big shock, but hey, you know, life has a habit of doing that. And I'm sure we're all mature enough and, and adult enough to deal with this in an adult way. And it certainly doesn't mean I'll be less of a father to Libby, or Mal, or Billy. Or... What? I need you to leave. Of course. I ap appreciate you being so understanding. It's a great relief. I'll see you soon. Just reporting the facts, doing my job. How do you judge me? You don't even know me. Oh, I think I do. What gave you the right? If you can't stand the heat, honey. <gasps> don't you dare call me, honey. Call you whatever Stop I want. It. Stop it now. This is hardly the time. Oh. I am not understanding. You are pathetic. You walk out of our marriage after 30 years because you want to be free. And within minutes, you're telling me you're going to be a daddy again. And then you have the nerve to thank me for taking it so well. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up and listen to me. I am not understanding. A couple of years ago, I wanted to have another baby. Do you remember? And you said no. You said this was our time. Time to do what we wanted to do. Time to spoil ourselves, you said. Well, you have spoiled my life. You have destroyed my happiness. And I am not understanding. From now on, Carl, expect nothing from me but hatred. I hate you. I hate you and what you've done to me and my family. 